You know at Local 4, we love to highlight organizations, events, and people that go for it and are doing things to make a difference in our community. If there's something that we can all agree on, bullying is something that needs to absolutely end. And this Friday night, Defeat the Label in conjunction with Motor City Casino Hotel Soundboard presents Bullying is No Joke 8, and you can see who it stars. Two-time Golden Globe winner, three-time Primetime Emmy Award winner, and stand-up comedian and podcast host Jeremy Piven. And he joins us now to talk about the event. Good morning, and thanks for talking with us in Detroit. Good morning. How are you? I'm doing great, and great to talk with you. You as well. Yeah, so let's start with this event. Bullying is no okay. joke. Why is it important for you to be a part of this message through comedy? Um, I, I think when, when you make people laugh, um, first of all, we all love to laugh, and we need to laugh now more than ever, I feel like. Um, and when you're talking about an issue like this, it's, it's good to come together and have a laugh. And then when you have that information kind of, you receive it, I think more profoundly, if you're not being yelled at, if you're not being bullied about bullying. How about that? <laughs> that makes perfect sense. Like you're having a conversation about it instead of feeling like someone is like instructing you on what not to do. Yeah. yeah. So it's not didactic. So exactly. you're not being hit over the head. Exactly. You know, these are all very strange metaphors when we're talking about bullying. <laughs> right. Well, people obviously know you from your roles on TV and in movies. But what do you love being on? What do you love about being on stage in addition to being in front of the camera? Well, I'm looking at myself on the camera right now and I'm going like, what happened to my face? <laughs> I'm looking incredibly puffy and, and not visually pleasing, so I'd like to apologize. Let's start there. Uh, I'm not a morning person. Um, <laughs> uh, I love I love stand up right now more than anything. It's uh, it's just a it, it's a way. I'm from the Midwest. I'm from Chicago. Actually, you know, a lot of the people in Detroit may know me as the guy. I used to do a lot of Chicago Blackhawks commercials where we chanted Detroit sucks. So I'd like to apologize for that. <laughs> well, we accept that apology, definitely. <laughs> definitely. Yeah. So you were <laughs> bullying Detroit then, and now you're like talking about anti-bullying. We love it. We love it. Yeah. So you also, Absolutely. <laughs> you also did a podcast called How You Live in J. Pivot. What did you enjoy about that form of media? Uh, I love the long form interviews. Uh, and, 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 you know, people do as well now. Uh, they're, they're, you know, they're becoming really popular, I think, for many reasons. I think also because everything is like in these little tiny little TikTok sound bites and people want to know who other people are and where they're coming from more. And so you're, we're all enjoying these long form conversations and I, I really love it. I'm having a, I'm having a blast doing it. And um, I've been working on a film for about 14 years that we're finding a home for right now called The Performance. Uh, and um, I have a, another film called Sweetwater about the first African-American to sign with the NBA, uh, where I play Coach Joe Lapchick of the New York Knicks. And um, so I, I got a lot of stuff going on and I, I love touring the country and I can't wait to head to Detroit. Yeah, we can't wait to have you. And it's really cool that you still get to do a little bit of everything that you love. Yeah, we, we are blessed and we, and we, uh, we all should be grateful. This has turned into a really bad TED talk. No, this is great. This is great. <laughs> but I have to ask you this. With all the characters that you've played from PCU to Entourage to Smoking Aces, which one do you think is closest to you in real life? That's a great question and really great question. And, you know, it's so funny because what that question really means is, are you Ari Gold? Are you an a And that's what it really means. And I understand that. And the reality is that um, <laughs> is that I'm closest to a character called Harold May that I play in the performance uh, that I can't wait to show you guys. And we're we're trying to figure out where the home is for it right now. But uh, I play a Jewish tap dancer, uh, and in an effort to become successful, hides the fact that he's Jewish and dances for Hitler oh, and very profound and heavy and 
Um, you know, it, it's the type of, t speaking about podcasts, it's the type of movie that I think will inspire a lot of interesting podcasts. Yeah, I definitely think it will. That That's heavy there. But you could make that funny and interesting, too. So thank you for telling us about that as well. What can people expect at the show? Um, it will be funnier than this interview. <laughs> that's all I can tell you. <laughs> <laughs> we'll take that. We'll take that. Jeremy Piven, thank you so much for being with us. Thank you so much. I'll see you soon. See you soon. Again, the event is Bullying is No Joke 8, starring Jeremy Piven. It is this Friday night at Soundboard at Motor City Casino. Tickets are available through Ticketmaster. This is a 21 and over show, so please keep that in mind.